I'd like to share a tag that I have done for Bridget. Um, I'm not, I put it, the information on what YouTube channel she is on, on the bottom. Um, I noticed on one of Bridget's videos that she was after a dress dye over in America that was discontinued and couldn't get it. But fortunately, we can still get it here in the UK. So I emailed her and asked her would she like me to get it for her. And she was like, yes, no problem, brilliant. Uh, but in the meantime, we're talking. She found out that I was after a dye as well with uh, the Sizzix Circles 2, which I've really struggled to get over here. So we're doing a dye swap. So I just wanted to send a little something with her to say thank you for doing that for me. And just a little piece of my sort of work, that type of stuff that I do, um, in with a dye. So. As I did for Angela's, I did a new one of these porcelain flowers, roses, and because I really like doing them. And I've used an, the scallops, scallop physics scallop tag dye, large scallop tag dye, I think it's called, scallop. Uh, and then I put some anagraphing paper over it, and underneath, inside the cage, there is a bird. And my idea was was to put the cage around it, the bird, so it looked cage, and I put glossy accents on on the bird. But once I put the cage on it, it really didn't couldn't see the bird very much. So that's why I then put this little vela on, which I'm so glad I did because it's just so cute with him on. And if you do look, you can still see a bird. There's like a bird inside and outside. Um, I then edged it with Victoria velvet. I think that's what the, the ink pads called. Um, and so to distress it and a bit of black soot I mixed in with it. And on the cage I've used tumble glass. I then rubbed stickles over it and then once I attached it um where the way I wanted it because I wanted it lifted up, see like that. Um I then put some glossy accents on it so to give it some more of a shine. And with the bird, I've used this, uh, I think it was rather sponge sugar or Victoria velvet again. And then I've used a, one of the browns on the log. Um, and then I've used a skittle to, for the eye for the bird. And then on this bee, it was a Making Memories metal bee. And then I put a load of pink skittles over it and glued them on with glossy accents and then we've got a Tim Holtz ticket saying saw and with one of the Tim Holtz pins and I've just used the same colour pinks and blues as I have done with everything else with all matches with the porcelain flower this I just 